acclimatize myself. It's not a meritocracy if you're a white male. They're openly saying we don't want you because you're a white male. Um, so I first want to validate this question 100% because, I mean, I just did Dr. Phil. I was sitting around with professors that were saying that they... Hello, so welcome again to another beautiful episode of Reaction on the channel. If you see me for the first time, you're welcome. My name is Daniel and you're welcome to Daniel React. What we do on this channel is to keep you entertained with a lot of engaging content that we also educate and also enlighten you in various aspects. So if this is what you love or you would love to watch, what you need to do is to hit on the subscribe button, like our videos and also drop a comment in the comment section telling us what you think and your thoughts about the video. So without further ado, don't forget to also share our videos. It helps us to build the brand better. And you can tend to support the channel with a little you can. Check the description, you will see um, buy me a coffee where you tend to support us with a little you can, which is on the screen. So thank you and let's dive into today's video. So it's kind of tough navigating the real world as a straight white male. How would it's how so would you, true? It's so sad. What is some of the best advice you could give a straight white male just trying to get through modern day America? This is honestly like the realest question I've ever been asked. I'm just, <laughs> I and I'm laughing because I feel so bad, and it's so crazy that we're here in life where like this should this is the question that was probably asked uh, by Black Americans anywhere as they came together during times of Jim Crow, and now suddenly it's like gosh, I, I better just problematize myself. It's not a meritocracy if you're a white male. They're openly saying we don't want you because you're a white male. Um, so I first want to validate this question 100% because, I mean, I just did Dr. Phil. I was sitting around with professors that were saying that they will not allow people into their school if they're white, right? Because it's just problematic to be white. Um, so the first thing I would say is that bless the fact that we live in this country and that you can be entrepreneurial and you can start your own businesses and you don't have to worry about what other people think about you or whether or not they like you. The second thing is that um, every person who is being treated like that needs to figuratively, nope, you know, figuratively grow a pair, right? Stop apologizing would be the first thing that I would say, right? The problem is that when you are being, yes, you should applaud that. Stop apologizing when you do nothing wrong. Um, and I think that what has happened is that people have been so afraid of being smeared that they just apologize even when they, when they don't mean it. And that is the first thing that weakens a person, is saying stuff that you don't mean. It doesn't just weaken the individual, it weakens society at large. Um, and so if you do something wrong, you obviously say sorry, but if you don't do something wrong, don't apologize. And know that you're, in, you're, you know, you're amongst friends when you're in a room filled with conservatives, whether they're black, white, Hispanic, we all know what's actually happening in this country. And I do think that the size of this room demonstrates the mist of a sea change. So stay firm. Um, let me have your own thought and view relating to this um, particular one and in line. Please and please drop it in the comment section. No insultive words. Let's know what um, cause uh, is seen in the comment section. So I'll be expecting your comments. Drop it in the comment section. So if you want us to be friends, why not? Hit on the subscribe button, turn on your post notification bell so you get notified by YouTube anytime you just like this drop. For all our returning subscribers, I appreciate you all for always coming back to check on any of the updates or videos we have on the channel. I appreciate you all. I don't take a lot for granted. You guys are the real MVP. So thank you guys. I appreciate you. Uh, I, I own a right to this particular one. All right belongs to the rightful content creator of this great piece of art, which I don't intend to infringe on the copyrighted materials. The main purpose of this video is to educate, enlighten you, and also inspire you. Um, and the little knowledge you haven't known. So thank you. If you intend to support this channel, why not? Check on the description, you'll see where you can support the channel. Buy me a coffee. That way you tend to support us with a little you can. Let's build the brand better. I know with your support, with everyone's support, with our collective support, this brand will further. So thank you. Don't forget to like, Help the algorithm to push this video to a larger audience and let's build the brand better. So, thank you. See you in the next one. Do what to stay put, stay safe, and stay subscribed. Before I forget, if you have a video recommendation you want me to react to, drop it also in the comment section. I'll be excited to react to the video of your choice. So, come your way. 
see you in the next video. It's bye for now.